What's up guys, this is The Rifleman and I am back bringing you to the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as the United Provinces. So to kind of run off happened last time, I captured London. I can't remember if we captured Edinburgh or not, but Edinburgh is smoking. And it looks like I'm on my way to destroying the British presence in Europe and also laying siege to multiple Swedish cities which were Prussian. And, oh my, I have pressed quite far along. So now is a good time, I think, to check my victory conditions. <laughs> so I own way more than I need to hold, 25, but I need to capture uh, 6 out of 13 special ones, which are all in India, probably. India and New York. Um, which is cool. Have I started in India? I have not. So what it's tempting to do is to not make this a world domination exactly, but just keep pushing on. That's what it's tempting to do. Oh, let's check. They're being replenished. Let's see, do I need to get my... Got my navy over here. Get them in. Transport, get these onto a ship, get them over to Dublin, where all of the missionaries are. If I knock Britain out of the game, maybe the United States forms for however long they will be in the game. I'm not sure what they were doing. They're all okay. Ah. They're waiting for some heavy cavalry to catch up. Ah, that's why Cherokee Territory is not converting. Okay, and I'm also pushing up... Yeah, I'm pushing up the East Coast up towards New York at the same time. Cool. Okay, research and tech. How are things going? Things are going very, very well to the point where I might not even need... Oh. Get them on carronades. Get Dundee on copper bottoms. Oh, actually, copper bottoms. Yeah, let's do copper bottoms. Because ultimately I don't need to defeat this navy if I just capture doublings. I'm pretty sure no other um, British air positions live in this part of the world. Um, my war with the Ottomans? I am at war with the Ottomans. Oh god, I have fingers in many, many pies. So push them down to Belgrade. I'm recruiting an army here. General's bodyguard backed up with two units of cuirassiers. Get some 32 pounders and 24 pounders. And get some cool light infantry. I've since upgraded the upgraded my uh, unit mod, so I've got lots of cool new units, which I'll not be able to really take advantage of um, in this game for as long as I'd like. Irregulars, pandas, blunderbuss, militia, conscripts. It's got grenadiers, Swiss lions, Swiss pikes, Swiss mountain jaegers. Let's some sharpshooters. Um, but I think, rather than getting too caught up in what I'm doing, should we just hit enter and see what happens? War I'm at war with pretty much everyone. Very friendly with Russia, very friendly with the Mughals. And Russia just doesn't exist anymore, except for in Archangelsk and in Estonia. Am I pushing... So I presume the plan is to attack, to attack Hanover, attack Hanover, then take these stacks and push north and start raiding Copenhagen and pushing on the Swedish Peninsula, I believe, I'd imagine, knowing me. Right, let's hit in turn. Ah, they're going on to Lisbon. So now this is where I fight a billion battles before the turns. Where are they going? 
Eh, they're trying to raid me, that's fine. Next turn, they will see if we get all the way to my turn. Peace treaty with Austria. Yes. Yep, if Britain wants to try and attack the Amsterdam, they are more than welcome. Amsterdam is fully garrisoned, and there's almost a full stack army sat right here just north of Brussels. Although, to be honest, it looks like no one's going to try fight me. Well, this is the thing, I need to push it to the Ottoman territory and quick. So you start pushing in, killing their units. Is well known with the Ottomans in this game, starting to really bog the game down. The Swedes gotta do. Oh. Yeah. Eh. Flee. If they chase me, yeah, that's fine. Let's see how many. Ships my second rates kill. Because I'm playing this right off the bat of recording a whole bunch of French. Ooh, I killed, so I lost two, but they lost eight. I am say that was almost a win. Weirdly. This won't be, though. Yeah, I managed to lose another, managed to trade two ships. Well, that's not so bad. And yeah, I'm coming off of this after recording. Literally about, I was playing the French, my French campaign for so long. Right, so let's get going. Yeah, I've been playing my French campaign for so long today, cause, um, which is good because it means I've got more in the bank. Because like I said in other videos, this is probably going to be very late because I've got three recorded that I didn't get around to uploading during my last stint. Um, so this will be quite late. Um, <laughs> yeah, like, I want to keep the rate of uploads sufficiently high not i'll have a, enough stored on on facebook to, not fa facebook and um, youtube to allow me to have a bit of that freedom to just publish okay so let's get ready so what i'm a bit cagey of is where the Reinforcements will come. Both my grenadiers on one flank. Ultimately, I'll keep these limbered up, actually, because you never know if I might need to unlimber. Keep my light infantry on the left. Cavalry on the left, jammer in the centre. Play. Oh, Holy moly. Get these guys back. So I want to move. Oh god, that cuff's not going to be good wherever that's aimed at. Cavalry. Okay, send the cavalry straight into him. Can't afford to wait. Um, Bring in the rest of my troops down here. See, that's superior line infantry. However, they are still... God alive. I need to... Yep, yeah, take him out.
as soon as I get them taken out or routing, I'm gonna fall they're gonna fall back. Start some counter battery fire. Because I'll successfully should make one of the batteries do counter battery fire, the other battery do shrapnel shot. No, they're just out of range. Counter battery fire it is, sir. Uh, guys again their flank on Just hit them in the flank okay no time to keep moving They're picking away my troops with canis with ball or round shot. It's okay. So I'm gonna mess myself blowing holes in their lines via canister. Actually, they might be okay up here on high ground. They can fire over my line. Because these are all my elite troops. They're falling back.
you get these guys should be getting sl they should be able to provide a so quite a serious amount of firepower against my guys my guys are all elites except for these guys these are no these are grenadiers Move up to the next ball neck. A set of dragoons is back here. That is what is here. Round shot. Target the horse. Good. Reload. <laughs> they got off. Have the cavalry abandoned the... They have. Good. Now they haven't abandoned them, they just hid. This could go very badly wrong. Winded troops versus eager and active. Careful of those stakes.
Mm, just keep chasing down the crews. Oh, loads of them are going to die on the stakes. Lots. Come on, Scots. Glorious Dutch Scots. Continue this actually. Let's take out superior line. These guys are going to go for line grenadiers. Weakened unit of grenadiers. Let's do that. And then let's. Halt my artillery. Superior line infantry not so superior when they flee. This is what can happen when the unit loses cohesion. Like your cavalry starts jotting around between the spots, between the big clumps rather than like attacking any clump. Three, two, one. I'm going to go after those grenadiers. More often than not, this is the reason why uh, they why units get to flee the field. Sometimes this is what causes them to be destroyed. Then they're done. Gone to this cavalry unit. Take them out. There's only two of them left. One. Phew. Right, now that's that Swedish stack dealt with. Um, let's see if another one rocks up. Ooh, lots of losses for their side. I've got a thousand more men. Opportunity to intercept. I think we should water resolve that. Yep. Do that, force them away. Oh, look at that. It's just left Gdansk open for the. Pushing. Oh. Holy moly. Well, let's get on with it. It's going to be a long part. <laughs> Many turns without. Ha I could doubt it's Sunday with. French Empire whereby I have where it's early game early game so the techs aren't quite well known Some riflemen this time. Hey. Okay, let's do that and that. Artillery on the hill, in amongst the no, not amongst the trees. Here. Dragoons off to the right. Guard Dragonier. 
Go General's bodyguard in the trees. Shrapnel shot. Quick, quick lime shells. Rush them up forward, I guess. Force them to do battle. I can get many, many good volleys off as well. There you go. Oh god, see that quick lime shells. Boom. That unit. Gone. Oh, sound bug. Patriot infantry. Don't aim too far to the right and hit my own men. So this tiny little unit of 14 guys is about to get shredded. Cavalry's coming out. Artillery on the right. Shrapnel shot. Target the Dragoons. Oh yes, they weren't shooting anything, so they're ready to rock and roll. Firing. F oh, f oh, moly. Delicious. And then back in position. Focus fire that square. They're forming tempting targets for Swedish gunners. You know what? Actually, I'm, I'm doing this all wrong. They're in a bottleneck. Why am I not taking advantage of them being in a bottleneck? Have my riflemen back here to protect. Artillery. Come on, get my houses in. Yes. I see them. Just suddenly, just got just oh, so little thought. There you go. Ran forward. They weren't expecting it. Well, to be honest, it looks like I've maxed it up because my troops aren't reloaded. The bayonet charging. Oh. Formed a square. They're about to get a pummel in. Oh, moly. Cavalry charge coming in. Fire at 
will. God damn it, 88th. God, shoot them. Get some sweeping shrapnel shots on them. It'd be beautiful. Took a pummel in. Pull two line infantry units off to toggle, sit there. And these forward. Spread them out, because cavalry. So only the front rank shoots drink for cavalry. Blow a hole in their own wall. You shrapnel shot, knock down that no, solid round shot, knock down that wall. Round you get out ready. Smash down this wall. Storm it, even though it's not an assault victory. I still want in. Has been shoot, being slaughtered. What range does my round shot have? Oh, lovely long range. Right, start dropping shots in on the dragoons. why he's routing. I'm not sure if it's something I've done or if it's just something that the game fancies doing. Either way, it doesn't matter. It's great. Just start climbing the walls, I guess. Horse artillery is coming out. Which takes lots of shots to kill artillery. Like, they can really soak up the punishment. <laughs> Swedish artillery. Swedish Cav, broken, oh, devastating volleys. See, these horse artillery teams, look, they're just right there. No one cares, they're not, they're not bothered, they don't care about musket shots. Ah, now they are. It's almost like, it feels like, uh, like, like generals, they have hit points, it feels like. These dragoons, poor buggers. Oh, I forgot all about these. 
Swedish reinforcements. Not many of them, to be fair. Well, this attack's gone fairly well. Oh, artillery's done well as well. My house is... Nice job. Quick lime shell, target the line. Ah, now you're screwed now. The rest of my line's infantry's arrived. Swedish curve unit, there's a Swedish curve unit. They're in Dragoons. Dragoons are a bit squishy. Well, they're in now. Turn off my howitzers before they kill all my own infantry. If I can tag them before they run. Oh, I think they glitched. Stuck in the tree. Good. Then you run forward and attack them. Oh god, we look so close in colour scheme! <laughs> Except the white trousers. So much blue and yellow. Brothers, brothers, we shouldn't be fighting each other, we should be fighting together. We should be united in a common enemy. A Judean people's front. Alright. Done. Steamroll straight onto them. Ah, they're gone as well. Oh, end battle. Oof. Swedes could have roasted. Excellent. Massive losses on the Swedish side. Hardly any on mine. They go, they fall back. Anyone else? Nope. There you go, that's on to Persia, Mughal Empire. Whew. Holy moly, there you go. Turn. <laughs> uh, during this part. Select. New town emerges in Hispaniola. How are you feeling? You feeling happy? Right, go craft workshops. Fleet destroyed. Oh, I remember you. Let's get through and do some. 
major investment. Palatial estates are fine. Let's hop over to Europe. So Spain still under siege with quite an effective overall army. But I've got quite a cool army too. Send these guys down. How many Portuguese? Oh, none. So Spain will be... This will be quite an interesting and easy capture. <laughs> but looking at the time, that's definitely the end of this part. So <laughs> thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.